name is Lawrence English and I've been researching the civil defense system here in Los Angeles for the past five years. It was designed so that if there was to be some kind of, in this case, nuclear attack, people in Los Angeles could have an early warning uh, that a potential attack was coming. From the 1950s until the 1970s, the sirens sounded weakly. And then in the mid-1970s, the civil defense system became less important to the city's infrastructure, specifically because the uh, Nike Ajax missiles that were located all across the city were removed. As Cold War tensions cooled, the system became less of a focus, and some of the signs began to fall into disrepair. By the early part of 1985, the system was in fact switched off officially by the city. So the civil defence sirens represented the way of understanding a kind of sonic topography that reveals two things. One, the, the social makeup of the city, where people lived and in what numbers, and also politically how it is that Los Angeles fits into a larger narrative here in North America and indeed globally, how it is that pressures such as the Cold War played out. When I started researching the civil defence system here in Los Angeles, I wasn't exactly sure where the research would take me. I became very interested in how it was that we might reactivate part of that system, reapproach this idea of uh, the sounding of Los Angeles. And from that, uh, the project CIRA was born. Specifically, the work is about resounding uh, these civil defense siren locations and creating a new way of understanding the downtown of Los Angeles through sound. 